Matt here with the latest tech news. Apple released a statement on Saturday, January 23rd, 2021, that there is precaution that you need to take if you have an implanted heart device like a defibrillator or a pacemaker when it comes to having an iPhone 12 or MagSafe accessories. So what does this mean? Well, it means that if you have one of these implanted heart devices, you need to take caution on not having your iPhone 12 or the MagSafe charging accessories too close because they could interfere with the performance of your implanted heart device. So the statement that Apple released on Saturday is, and I quote, Medical devices such as implanted pacemakers and defibrillators might contain sensors that respond to magnets and radios when in close contact. To avoid any potential interactions with these devices, keep your iPhone and MagSafe accessories a safe distance away from your device. Now, how far away are they recommending? More than 6 inches or 15 centimeters apart or more than 12 inches or 30 centimeters apart if wirelessly charging, but consult with your physician and your device manufacturer for specific guidelines. So they said here MagSafe accessories, and so they, they released an additional statement, which I quote, all MagSafe, MagSafe accessories, each sold separately, also contain magnets, and MagSafe charger and MagSafe duo charger contain radios. These magnets and electromagnetic fields might interfere with medical devices. So that's why they're mentioning the MagSafe uh, accessories is because they have those radios in them that can interfere with the built-in heart device. Now, what caused Apple to release this statement? Well, it's not exactly known why, but um, there was uh, an article that was put out on heartrhythmjournal.com, and this article was, uh, was posted on January 4th, 2021. It's talking about was a situation where they did a study on a subject who had a implanted defibrillator and they had an iPhone 12 that they put uh, near this person's left side of their chest and to see if there would be any sort of effect on it. And what they posted here on the website, they tested the, the interaction on a patient with a Medtronic Inc. ICD. The ICD is the uh, built-in a heart device and it says once the iPhone was brought close to the ICD over the left chest area immediate suspension of ICD therapies was noticed was noted which persisted for the duration of the test this was reproduced multiple times with different positions of the phone over the pocket so as you can see here in in the image they have the phone over the pocket of this over this left chest area of the subject and it did affect their implanted device, the ICD. So it is cause for concern. A little further down on the page, they say a recent case reported highlighted magnetic interference with a fitness tracker wristband deactivating an ICD up to distances of 2.4 centimeters. So iPhone 12 and the MagSafe accessories are not the only thing that could interfere with an implanted heart device like a pacemaker or a defibrillator. So if you have an implanted heart device, please take caution. If you already own an iPhone 12 and a MagSafe uh, accessory, to keep your device more than six inches away and definitely more than 12 inches away if you're charging it on the MagSafe uh, char wireless charger. Now, does this mean that you shouldn't go out and buy an iPhone 12? That question needs to be answered by you and your physician to make that decision and to know if this device is safe for you. And definitely, I wouldn't recommend it for anyone, really. It's not really a good idea to put your device in your shirt pocket right next to your heart. Um, keep it, you, you know, keep it in another pocket or keep it somewhere that is not on your body. So essentially what the iPhone 12 
they have been constructed with uh, an array of uh, magnets in the back of the phone and they have more magnets than prior models so that they can work better with these MagSafe wireless chargers. So that is the concern that they're seeing here is because they have stronger magnets in them and then compounded with the, the radio uh, waves from the MagSafe charger, MagSafe accessories, is not a good uh, combination for people with implanted heart devices. So please let other people know about this. Give this video a like so that YouTube will share it out so that you can let we can let other people know about the situation and subscribe to my channel for more tech updates like this one and I'll see you in the next video.